Thank you for stopping by my channel. Today I'm going to be doing this look which was inspired by Harley Quinn from the movie Suicide Squad. So keep watching to see how I did this look. So to start I have already applied my eyebrows, foundation, a little bit of concealer, bronzer, and also a little bit of contour. And next up I'm going to be applying Thank Me Later eyeshadow primer from Elizabeth Mott. And I'm using the Mi Vita Loca palette from Kat Von D. And first I'm going to use the color Molder to just set the eyeshadow primer. I'm going to be using the color Destroyer and Dark Wave. I'm going to go ahead and start with my right side, which is our red side. I'm using a Luxie Small Tapered Blending Brush and the color destroyer which is a light red color and i'm just gonna start applying that red shadow all over the eyelid to start and i'm gonna layer that to make the color a little bit more intense and since harley quinn definitely goes a little crazy with the eyeshadow we're just gonna keep building that on up towards the eyebrow and for this look, it definitely does not need to be perfect. Just layer that shadow on. And go ahead and even extend that shadow towards the outside here. And I'm going to take that same red shadow and just start to apply that under the eye also. It's kind of all over. And since this is a really, since this is a very decent sized brush, you're gonna just get a ton of color on there easily. These pigtails are too much fun. Just cleaning that up a little. And now for my left side or our blue side I am using the color dark wave same deal just go ahead and start applying that blue color all over the eyelid go ahead and just keep layering and then start to build it up and I'm gonna go almost to the eyebrow but not quite all the way there and same deal I'm extending this out on the side also. How crazy would it be if you wore something like this to work? I guess it depends on where you work. It could be cool if you worked at a movie theater. And then same deal, I'm taking the blue color and applying that also all around the eye underneath. And next, Harley Quinn has a ton of black eyeliner that I love. Tight line using Smashbox Raven Liner and line the waterline with Marc Jacobs Gel Crayon. And I just got this Kaylin Eye Jumbo Liquid Liner. I won it in a giveaway and I'm excited to try it. Like a giant felt tip. And I'm going to use this to just apply a bunch of liner kind of messy and black on the top here. Anyway, how often do you not have to worry about your makeup being messy? This is just like, go for it. Have fun. And this applies really nice on the top. Obviously, if you're not doing this kind of look, definitely do not use it on the bottom. But it makes it nice and messy, which is, Totally the look we are going for. I'm applying Mary Kay's Lash Intensity Mascara on the top and bottom lashes. And then I'm going to deliberately add a little bit of mascara to like make it a little bit deliberately messy. Like that. 
I want to use some giant lashes, so I'm using Scarlet Number no. 8. And I'm using Duo Dark Tone Adhesive to apply the lashes. Please do check out these gorgeous, gorgeous lashes. Like I said earlier, I have already applied foundation, bronzer, a little contour. So feel free to do that on your own. I definitely think that Harley Quinn can rock a little bit of highlighter pretty much all over her face. This is Indiscretion from Laura Mercier. And I'm just gonna kind of apply this like a little bit like blush, a little bit on my forehead, a little bit on my nose, Cupid's bow, even a tiny bit on my chin, which I never do. Just get a little bit of glow going. I have two more eyeliners from Kaylin. And one is I Define Liquid Eyeliner, and one is I Graphic Liquid Eyeliner. And I'm gonna use one of these to do the little heart on the cheek. And I think I'm gonna try eye graphic because I think this one might be more for drawing. But I gotta figure out which side we gotta do the heart on. All right, folks, so the heart is on my right side, your right side, or the red side. I have to say these little ribbons I put in my hair are very helpful for keeping our sides identified. So this eye graphic liquid liner is perfect because it just is just applying just like a pen. Holy business, people, this eye graphic liner was literally perfect to do this heart. It was so easy. So if you want to draw hearts or stars or pretty much anything on your face, this is what you want. I want to just start drawing things on my face every day now because that was so easy. And of course, our look would not be complete without some major red lips. Kaylin Extreme Matte Tint in this bright red. It's number four. This liquid lipstick is just super bright red, which could not be more perfect for this look. So here is our final look inspired by Harley Quinn. I think this is the perfect look to wear to go see Suicide Squad on August 5th when it comes out in theaters. So let me know if you're going to try this look out, if you see the movie, what you think of it, and I will definitely be watching too. watching I hope you enjoyed this video and please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and also please subscribe to my channel if you already haven't I'm known for being quite vexing I'm just forewarning you what was that I should kill everyone and escape sorry it's the voices <laughs> 
I'm kidding. That's not what they really said. Making such a mess. I don't know what is up with flies on me today. It's my second one I've run into. <laughs> this is so much gum I'm trying to chew. Actually, it's only two pieces. <laughs> my bubble's gonna be amazing. <sighs> the saddest little thing ever.